great place. What a beautiful day for us to do this. But, so let's talk a little bit about what's happening this weekend, okay? So this weekend, all over America, we're going to put flags on gravestones from those people who gave their lives to protect our way of life, right? We're going to have local officials like me who are going to come out and wow the masses with our words and tell people how great these people were and how it absolutely changed our lives, which is 100% true. But if that's what this weekend is all about, then I find it completely inadequate when you compare it to the sacrifice that all those people who gave their lives for us, what they gave. Okay, so how about this? This is what I'm going to ask, and we've got the perfect generation to do this with, but it applies to everybody else too. How about if we all commit, individually and collectively, we commit to living the kind of lives and building the kind of community that is worthy of the sacrifice that was given to all of us, right? This rests with you guys, doing the right things, the right ways, all the time, because that's what was given to you, right? And if that's why we're here, then I can think of no better place to do a ceremony like this than right here. So this park was created solely to make our community a better place and improve the quality of life of individuals, right? And so many of the people that you're gonna hear from today that's what they spend their lives doing. And if that's what we're doing this weekend, if that's what we're committing to, then I think that's absolutely adequate. It's an absolutely adequate way to thank all the people uh, that have come here before us. I'm so thankful to be here. I'm so thankful that all of you guys are here. Um, I love this place, I love this flag, and I thank God every day that the people who came before us, our friends, our families, our ancestors, who sacrificed, made the ultimate sacrifice they did it so that we could have a day like this. Thank you guys very much. Thank you for being here. And now I get the distinct honor of introducing His Eminence, the Mayor of Searing. <laughs> 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 interested in just the city of Ames to form this chapter. Uh, our good friend and adopted Vietnam veteran associate, uh, he started he started our, our chapter by working and by contacting the uh, Vietnam veterans to organize this chapter.
education about how to put that in the forefront of their mind. Um, kids and adults both. And, and we do that by, by providing numerous amenities all across the county. Um, trails, hiking, biking trails, now water trails. We've got a designated water trail in the county. Um, campgrounds, fishing lakes, campgrounds.
right, everybody standing. Right hand over your heart. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States. Closing today, I'm going to have uh, Story County Veterans Affairs Commissioner Pat Pekin play Pat. Before he does, I want to thank everyone for coming. God bless America and God bless our flag.